Hi, my beautiful Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Natasha, Goddess of Life 1111. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. This reading is for my lovely Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe. Universal energy. My ancestor, my spirit guide, the pure white light, Archangel Michael, Ascended Masters. Please give my lovely Aquarius a clear, precise, honest message. This is a general love reading. It won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, please check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Thank you so much to all my Aquarius that have been supporting my channel. I'm grateful and thankful and I'm sending lots of love, blessing and prosperity your way. So you have the Knight of Cups in the it. Wow. Okay. Aquarius. I feel like you are talking to someone. It could be a fire sign, but you feel like this is this is a dream come true. You guys get to communicate. That's what I'm feeling here for you. You feel like this is a dream come true to communicate with this person. Mm -hmm. you, your wish, your dream come true. You're happy about that. May I have two cards, please, for the person Aquarius is dealing with? Two cards for the person Aquarius is dealing with. Knight of Wands, like I say, you could be dealing, uh, you could be talking to a fire sign, but I feel like there's a uh, situation and outcome here. The situation that which is completion. One more card, please, for this person Aquarius is dealing with. You know, the third eye chakra, so you, yeah, there's someone that's very intuitive here, so they need to open their eyes. Um, when it's come to you, there's something this person is not seeing. May I have two cards, please, for. A lovely Aquarius. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're not. What they're not see is her uh, hot and caliente. You find this person. How you um, passionate about this person, and you want a brand new sexual passionate <laughs> beginning with this person. I'm just. This is what I'm feeling. But. You try to tame in yourself, see? Seven of Swords. You try to tame in yourself and try to have control over yourself, but you're not telling this person how you're feeling, but secretly, this is how you're feeling. I feel like the Seven of Swords here, this is how you're feeling. You secretly want to devour this person. Um, I'm, <laughs> listen, don't kill the message. That's what I'm feeling because you feel like you feel like talking to this person, but I feel like they've been to a lot. This is someone that, you know, they they, they are in the uh, wounded warrior. Like they've been through a lot. They are resting, they are healings. This is someone that could be also in isolation currently. And they are doing a lot of persevere when it's come to their love lives. You know, that's what I'm feeling here for you guys. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm my chair may I have two cards please for the person Aquarius is dealing with two cards for the person Aquarius is dealing with spirit heart to heart conversation honestly discuss your feelings with each other one more card for this person Aquarius is so enamored with yeah it is safe for you to love. So like I said, this person could be very guarded and they're not seeing some things when it's like, I, because it is safe for you to love. It's on a reverse. So yeah, this is someone that could be afraid of getting into any type of connection. When it's come to their love life, they are very, very close up. That's what I'm feeling here. Whomever you are dealing with. May I have two cards, please, for Aquarius spirit? Yeah, this person is very close off. Yeah, reconciliation, you deserve love. Wow, okay. <laughs> May I have two cards, please, for Aquarius? You want a reconciliation with this person. May I have two cards for Aquarius spirit? Two cards for Aquarius Man, I've been trying to avoid that. Is that? Mm. 
So, what I'm feeling here, especially dealing with you, this person could feel like you are controlling. That's what I'm feeling here. Someone in here feel like you are a bit controlling, Aqua. So you might need to um turn it down a bit, I guess. I don't know what to tell you. I have one more quest for Aquarius. Honeymoon. I feel like eventually you want to move forward with this person. You want to move some type of healing with this person. See, and we quite it. Love is at the bottom. This could be the one. Love yourself first. Deception. Yeah, of course. So I feel like, yeah, you you want to move forward, you know, with this person. Uh, and you are going to, because you're in the Six of Swords. You're in the Six of Swords here. But I feel like this person doesn't trust you. Because they feel like you could be a little bit controlling. So I'm just telling you what I see. Don't kill the messenger here. I am just the messenger. I have three cards, please, for the person I pray is dealing with. The sun. So you could be dealing with a Leo. Yeah, something is come to, you know, some something is come to light here. So they have the devil. And they have Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, someone in here is a bit, you know. <clears throat> the Knight of Wands, the Devil, and the Sun. So this is someone that I feel like this person has got like some type of, you know, they might have like a little bit of toxicity or this is you. Because um, this person is very happy. They are very, they like, you know, wherever they are, they make the, you know, the light, you know, the sunshine, you know, wherever they go and stuff like that. With the Knight of Wands, again, this is someone in here could be you or this person. Someone have a tendency of in and out. Also, this is someone that take action. They're very, they're very fiery. That's what I'm feeling here. And you like that about this person. And you feel like they are the devil because of their passion. I feel like someone in here has a lot of passion. They're very... Uh, passionate, very sensual with the devil. May I have two cards, please? For Aquarius spirit. Yeah, it's of swords. The truth is coming out. Two cards for Aquarius. The emperor. So yeah, like I said, you will be dealing with the fire sign or this is you, five of wands. Yeah, someone in here doesn't want to have the top because the emperor usually you know be in control of the emotion here eight of swords and the uh ace of pentacles i feel like you might be you know someone is afraid to keep you know the other person in their head that's what i'm feeling is someone doesn't want to be trapped in a situation so because of that they uh keep in control i feel like you are very in control of your emotion here very is you know you are playing some type of game here with the five of wands. Why is the devil here? Clever the devil. Ah, King of Cups. Okay, Aquarius. So this is you. So you upset. Someone is obsessed with someone here. The King of Cups and the Devil. This is someone that's literally someone at the distance. Yeah, someone in here is, is obsessed. <clears throat> could there could be a Capricorn that's have Scorpio in the chart that is obsessed with with someone here. Let's see. Clarify the King of Cups. I want to see who this person is obsessed with. Clarify the King of Cups. They're obsessed to have a family dynamic. Wow, Aquarius, this is you. Having long-term stability, having, you know, money, have a lot of money. That's what I'm feeling here. I feel like someone in here, they you know, that's the main focus here. Ten of Pentacles to have this person has the wife, uh, you know, wife or husband here. 
because i feel like there's a divine masculine um because capricorn energy is very masculine someone in his very um two of pentacles they want balance so i feel like the two of pentacles has want the relationship uh, a commitment a balance clarify the sun I feel like you want to have children, or this person might have children, but you guys want children together. Your energy is all over the place. They are known, but the thing is that is that someone might not want that. I feel like someone in here might not want children, but you do. There's someone that's already have children, and you might want children, and this person might not. What I heard is barren, but I don't think this person barren. I think they already have kids. That's what I'm seeing. So for the Knight of Wands. The chariot. So yes. You want to move forward with this person. You want to move forward with this person. You do. See? Page of Pentacles. You want children with this person. What about the Page of Pentacles? None of Cups. You guys, each other's wish fulfillment. Because they have the Nine of Cups, so are you. Because this is your reading. Yeah, you want a very passionate new beginning, Three of Pentacles, to work with someone here, especially financially. Five of Pentacles, um, I feel like in the past, someone feel betrayed and the other one feel have victory. Someone was betrayed in the past. Someone backstabbed in the past. With five of pentacles here, and you probably go. I feel like you end up being very victorious here and successful. And the hierophant, and after this person betrayed, they are also become successful. Well, of course, yes. Let's see, because you want this passion in the beginning with this person to work together, to partner. And if I five of ones. Eight of Wands. This person might have a lot of competitions. Clap for the Eight of Wands. You're dealing with someone that's have a lot of competition. Or mm -hmm. five of pins, five of cups. Clap for the five of cups. See, someone is feeling like a lot of regrets and stuff. A lot of regret and remorse. Oof. Yeah, about the a new beginning here. Someone lost a new beginning and they feel a lot of regret and remorse because they realize that someone is very popular. Clarify the emperor because I feel like you are you coming as the emperor here, standing in your ground. See, oh, okay. I've never known the emperor to be um upright to be doing any type of competition or or things like that. I don't know any emperor that does have this person must be having a lot of people um competing for their attention yeah i see the sun in the reverse there was some type of ending here with the um there was a relationship that was ended or this you know there could be a false relationship also look at that ace of swords Ace of Swords in the King of Wands. So yeah, like I said, you could be dealing with a fire sign, Aquarius. That is very, very. They are being truthful. They want victory. They want success with you. And they are very, very passionate about you. They are very attracted to you. Because you are their wish fulfillment. No one ever make them feel this way sexually. Mm. Clarify. Okay, okay. go with your bad self. Why this sneakiness? Why don't you just tell the truth? Because I feel like you, you guys are hot and bothered, but you're not the because this is like someone who's not telling the truth here with the will of fortune. Realize that this relationship still got cycle in it. Why is the Seven of Swords for Aquarius? Yeah, like tell the truth. I feel like you want to be with this person. They want to be with you too. 
So clarify the uh, the sun, please, and the reverse for Aquarius. Where's the sun and the reverse? Mm -hmm. Clarify the sun and the reverse. The lovers. Yeah, someone will go ahead, you know, get into some type of commitment in here, but this person feel the bonds between you guys because, like I said, this person end up in a new relationship and all they were and they had a lot of arguing a lot of fighting see look at that the knight of cups here two uh, three times three times like i say you guys are each other wish fulfillment here <clears throat> i don't feel like there is any like a drinking i just feel like you both are single you both act as as such but you're still both each other's wish fulfillment wow because the the sexual uh energy between you guys is on fire and someone started a very passionate new beginning with someone and then it's end up being a disaster that's what i'm feeling here either you or this person i feel like this person they have a lot of regret because whatever new beginning they they had started it was a disaster i'm just telling you and there was a total of nine i mean nine nine and another nine so this is whatever this is is complete and i feel like you're gonna walk away from this situation because this person might not be open up see because they don't want to get hurt again they don't want to betray this is someone that do have a lot of feelings for you they feel a lot of passion for you they desire you but they feel to get hurt again see they they feel like they've been betrayed already so they don't want they when it's come to relationship they close the factory i'm sorry to tell you the passion is there everything is there it's just the person afraid to get hurt no one do it for see luck is on your side no moon in sagittarius oh so if you have to wait until um sagittarius season you have long way to go boy <laughs> oh girl <laughs> wow someone got a long way to go here communication is the key yeah that's what i'm saying don't sneak around just communicate with this person what you want i think that will make more sense i feel like there's two cards in here i don't know something feel heavy that's what i'm saying so you when you guys might feel work through your fears no moon in scorpio so yeah so i feel like when by the time no moon in scorpio you'll be talking to this person i felt i feel like that after that sagittarius yeah so you're gonna feel a little bit more comfortable to open up to this person and then by no moon in scorpio you probably i mean they uh no moon in Sagittarius, you probably take things to the next level to say something. But I, until then, I feel like you're gonna go with the flow. Communicate is the communication is the key here. No moon in Gemini, so you have the way no moon to make things happen. No moon in Gemini, no moon in Scorpio, and no moon in Sagittarius. My lovely, my lovely, my lovely Aquarius. It was nice doing your reading. As much as passion you guys have for each other, I feel like you're not going to take any action so this this person because they are guarded and you are afraid. And the truth is in stuff, there's a lot of passion. A lot of passion. Mm, they have a lot of feelings for you. They you still, you are their wish fulfillment. They desire you. They want you, but they're not going to say anything. Someone is here who got it. And you, I feel like you have fear. You have fear of rejection. You're not going to say anything. But they want that passionate no beginning with you. All right, Aquarius. That's all I have for you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. Bye, Aquarius.